Hey y'all, welcome to fourth grade, chapter eight, lesson one. We're gonna go ahead and get started. So before we do, I'm just gonna show you um, what this means. So all this means is that you have one ace and you have seven of those. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, okay? So you have seven of those, okay? So all it means is one eighth times seven, done, okay? So this one is gonna, the denominator is three. So you're gonna have one third and you have five of them. Boom, done, okay? So I want you guys to do four through nine because you totally can, okay? Just because this number is big does not change anything. I will do number nine with you. One one hundredth times 13. Done. Okay. It, don't make it harder than it's got to be, guys. Okay. So the next one, again, super easy. Okay. So one fifth. Okay. This means, oh, sorry. So instead of one fifth, it's going to be two fifths. And then three fifths, and then four fifths, and then five fifths. Okay? You guys do number 11. Okay? That's all it is, guys, is going up the next number and keeping the same denominator. Okay? This says so far, Monica has read five sixths of a book. She's read the same number of pages each day for five days. So, what fraction of the book does Monica read each day? Well, that five split up into five days is going to be one sixth each day. So one sixth of the book. Done. Okay. All this means is she did one sixth, one sixth, one sixth, one sixth, and one sixth. Okay. So for five days. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, that totals five, six, and she did it in five days, which means that's one day's worth, okay? All right, Nicholas buys three eighths of a pound of cheese. He puts the same amount of cheese on three sandwiches, okay? So again, one eighth, one eighth, and one eighth, okay? So he puts the same amount of cheese on one, two, three sandwiches, okay? So one eighth, two eighths, three eighths, it adds up, and we split it up into the three. Okay? So how much cheese does he put on one sandwich? One eighth. One eighth of a pound. Done. Okay? Don't make it harder than it's gotta be, guys. Okay? I'm going to go over to the back. You guys are gonna do the lesson check. And we're gonna do the spell review. It says. Liza bought five eighths of a pound of trail mix. She gives two eighths of a pound of trail mix to Michael. How much trail mix does Liza have left? So five eighths minus the two eighths. Okay. When we're adding and subtracting fractions, we have a common denominator, so it's going to stay the same. Then you just do five minus two is three. Three eighths. We're done. Three eighths, and it's being measured in pounds. Three eighths of a pound, guys. Okay. All right. Lee has a piece of rope that is six and two thirds feet long. How do you write six and two thirds as a fraction greater than one? All right. So we need to dead man it. Okay. That's all that means is to make it into an improper fraction. So we're going to do dead man. Okay. So six and two thirds. Okay. Since we're going to do dead man, let's do some Halloween colors. Okay, you will notice that kind of looks like a dead man. So we affectionately call it dead man, okay? So that three times six is 18, plus two more is 20. And I keep my denominator. That's it guys, 20 over three. Done, okay? All right. A group of students have the following house numbers. 29, 39, 59, and 79. Randy's 
house number is a composite number. What is Randy's house number? Well, a composite number, that would be 39, guys. Done. Okay. Mindy buys 12 cupcakes. Nine of the cupcakes have chocolate frosting. What fraction of the cake, uh, sorry, of the cupcakes have vanilla frosting, okay? So I would do that 12 and I would take away the nine that have chocolate frosting, okay? Which leaves me with three, right? Oops, sorry guys, can't see that, okay? So leaves me with three. Well, three and there's 12 total. So that's my fraction. Now, if you want to, that can be reduced. Three goes into three one time and three goes into 12 four times. So you can put three twelfths or you can put one quarter. All right, y'all. Thanks for hanging out for 8.1. Come on back for 8.2. See you soon.